the work done by a force is defined as the product of the force multiplied by the distance travelled in the direction of the force. The force needs to be in newtons and the distance needs to be in metres and then the work done will be in joules. In this example the force is the weight of the object and therefore the formula force times distance becomes mg the weight multiplied by the distance. We use the same formula to work out the work done against a force. So the work done against resistance here is the magnitude of the resisting force multiplied by the distance travelled in the direction of the force. Before we can work out the work done against friction, we need to find the magnitude of the friction. We can resolve vertically to find the normal reaction, and then since the object is moving, we can use F equals mu R to find the magnitude of the frictional force. The work done against friction is then just the product of the magnitude of the frictional force multiplied by the distance travelled. To find the work done against gravity, we will need to multiply the weight of the object by the vertical distance risen. To calculate the work done against friction, we'll need to first of all work out the magnitude of the frictional force. So we can resolve perpendicular to plane to find the normal reaction, and then since the object is moving, we can then use the F equals mu R, and finally, we can then work out the work done against friction by using the product of the friction and the distance travelled in the direction of the force. If the force is not in the direction of motion, we find the component of the force that is in the direction of motion and then the formula work done equals magnitude of force times distance travelled in the direction of the force now becomes work done equals F cos theta multiplied by S. As the force is not acting in the direction of motion, we need to use the formula that the work done is F cos theta multiplied by S. To find the work done against the force, we can still use the same formula, work done equals F cos theta multiplied by S.